What's going on guys? Today we got a little bit of a glove review. Today what we're going to be reviewing is the new Rawlings R9. So just off the jump, I think, uh, looking at this glove, this is a, a kid's type glove. So that's, that's really who they're marketing to right here. Kind of appears to be perfect. You know, it's, this is an 11 inch, still an infielder's glove. You get it for a kid that's like nine, 10. They can use this up until they're probably 13, 14. I mean, really, if you like 11 inch gloves, it's just a good option to have overall. Rawlings Heart of the Hide infield glove right here. The leathers aren't exactly the same, obviously, but still very good quality here. Mm. So where you put your hand in right there, it's a little bit small. Like, I think that's as far as I can really get my hand in the glove. But like I said, it's for kids. And so the fingers only go up to a certain certain length too. Got a good web. The colors are very nice. Just aesthetically, this is a very good looking glove that I would say for any kid that's like eight to 13, 14, this would be a perfect glove. I mean, you really can't beat this. 11 inches, like I said. It's a great size for that age. Really lets you use your hands more and not have a glove that's too big or too small. As you'll see a lot of the times when they get to that, that kind of weird in-between age where it's like, do I buy them a nice glove? Do I stay with the glove they've had since they were like a, like a child? But I think this fits that mold perfectly. Uh, it's a lot like the kind of the gold gloves they used to have, but the gold gloves weren't made for that age like same price range um, I think a lot better looking more more web options like it's almost like a railroad track web option or it looks like seams I don't really like that web huh but yeah this is the R9 series got the red R9 right there it's a pretty sick glove Got this, it's like the same design, really, on the inside as, as this part of the hide is. Comparatively, thank you for your for talking steps here. You go R9 at about 8 or 9 to 13. You could probably use this glove as long as it, as it stays the course and doesn't really fall apart. And then once you turn 13, 14, that's when you get into a little bit of the bigger gloves, like the Heart of the Hide series, which I mean, just a classic. Everybody loves a good Heart of the Hide. And then of course you can you can upgrade to a Pro Preferred if you like, if you like that harder leather. Um, but this R9 is kind of going to fit that mold where you don't want to spend $200, $300 on a glove, but you can still get a good glove for about $140. It's literally like a Heart of the Hide for a kid. Like it'd be like a pro for I mean, not many gloves fit for kids this way like this one is. Like this is literally made for your kid that's going through, that's starting to get serious about baseball, but you still don't want to spend that money of $200 to get a glove that's going to be massive on their hand, and this glove is going to fit every single need that you have for, for a child that age. 